Hello everyone, this is KJ. Welcome back to Subsistence. I have some stuff and things to show you. <laughs> I finally found a cotton plant and I took a picture of it. And then I was waiting for the sun to come up and I accidentally picked it. Uh, let's see here. We don't need to start that till we have food. Yeah, I've got a bunch of loot on me here. And we'll just dump it and cotton, that cotton plant. Very echoey today. Not sure, oh, did I turn the volume down? Is that what it was? I did, I remember doing it. Um, doesn't really help. All right. Oh, there we go, there's a thing. Just trying to put it all away before I get it all out. Does that make sense? Uh, no, we don't need to do that. We do need some water and a little bit of that. We need to go hunting. And uh, I have done um, an amount of hunting. I have 81 of those. <laughs> uh, that's full. Uh, this is uh, full. And it is ready for our first solar panel. So let's go get the stuff. Uh, if I can remember, that was for the coat. I also made some uh, metal ingots and dumped a lot of fish in here to rot so we can make heat packs. There's my rope. All right. This is gonna take all the power, but it's gonna help us get some of the power back for us. <laughs> Uh, it only took us down to 618, which is pretty darn good. All right. Now then, this has to be in the range of the uh, BCU, which means right here. That's not good. Um, this is not good. We need to build a range extender. Uh, huh? How about right there? Uh, it's kind of a cloudy day. Uh, we are getting... My eyes won't focus. Um, where did the... There it is. 60... No, 89% light. That's not that bad. That is not bad. And I think that was 0 0.2... Uh, 0 0.6. 0 0.8. It's going up a little tiny bit. 0.8. Uh, per second coming in, um, point zero 0.08 actually, so we're going to have to do that again. Um, but next up is making the coat, and let's just review here what all we need. Padded cloth, cotton, regular cloth, and two ropes, regular cloth. Is it six? No, it's eight. It's very hard to see these numbers. And I ran into a cougar, so I have that. Yeah, I ran into the cougar. It was not intentional. We can make two. We're still, oops, we're still going to have to go get uh, quite a bit more. Did I need that? I think I need that. Cotton. This is a huge uh, load off my mind, being able to make this coat and put it away. Um, I've been like super worried, <laughs> especially uh, at night when it's like zero degrees. So here's our coat. We are safe for winter. I got a ton of pearls, which means I can make more circuit boards. Might have the mass to make a couple and we're gonna put this in here right there where I'll see it all the time and uh, I wish that I had enough to make the vest too but that is nine more sinew which is two more cougars and if we run into one today that'll be something um, uh, oh, circuit boards, right. Uh, let's see here. Uh, we need 
um, electrical components and copper. So we've got that, and we are uh, overflowed now on uh, metal scrap. And we have a little bit of power and mass left. So let's go ahead and make these. Nope, I'm out of mass there. Okay. No problem. Let's put those away. Those away. And that and that. I think I like that better over there. All right, now there is something else. Five padded cloth. Uh, that is not enough to make that. So that would be 15 cotton. So let's go harvest. And then we can plant 12 cotton. That's already loaded. I think I watered it and fed it like seconds before it was done growing. So there's four of those and five of those. We'll have a tomato seed left over. <laughs> and that is, that's absolutely perfect because um, four cotton and four tomatoes is a lot of food and a lot of padding. <laughs> and we'll put the tomato back. Maybe eat an apple too. Let's see what I've done. I've made arrows. I don't need shotgun shells yet. Uh, oops, wrong button. This button right here. Um, handgun kills, M9 pistol kills. Uh, we are now at six bears. <laughs> uh, it takes um, a lot of bullets to kill a bear. So I've been using the shotgun like only on wolves. And um, because you can only fire one shot and then you got to move because you have to... Um, you have to re you have to load. There's a loading sequence. I mean, the gun's already loaded, but for whatever reason, there's a loading sequence in there. And uh, yeah, it takes it takes some effort. I, I completely forgot why I was out here. It's not for this or this. <laughs> Need some steak. None of these things are steak. They don't even look like steak. It's an incredibly rich fiber run, though. Uh, I was going to say next up is a fridge. There's one right there. Um, but I'm thinking... Um, the thing is, the reason that I want to make a fridge is because I'm tired of going hunting every day. And... Um, that's the only reason so we don't really need it and we do need other things like more mass storage and more power storage and we also need several more solar panels and before winter a wind turbine or two or three because uh, the it's gonna be really stormy I think and wind turbines work in the storms where Solar panels, not so much. And solar panels don't work at night. So if there's a storm at night, uh, we can pick up that power with the turbines. But the next thing that we have to make is actually a BCU extender. Because our base is too wide and we can't extend. <laughs> We can't move that solar panel very far away from the BCU, so we'll have to do that. And uh, I think we'll wash our hands here. I'm not going cougar hunting in the rain. It's already uh, too cold and there's probably mooses. So I think that uh, we will build instead. This is why I turned down the volume. 
before was the sound of thunder. It was so loud. I was hoping to find another cotton plant. Uh, I tried really hard. So upon review of the episode, the last, uh, the episode before last, when we first got our um, lock crate key, and I decided to go search for a lock crate, failed. That episode, I, um, actually that's a black bear. Ah, you know what? Let's not. Let's say we did and don't. Just said I'm not feeling it today. <laughs> hey, you're a white flower. Stop looking like cotton. <laughs> uh, so upon review of the episode where we initially got the key, um, I can see a crate quite clearly. Lock crate in the video. And, um, yeah. Yeah, that happens because... Um, concentrating on too many things, for one, and they can be hard to see. Oh my god, it's so loud. It's ridiculous how loud that thunder is. Are we done yet? Yeah. I could read the information at the bottom of the screen. It tells me. Uh, that I got the tree grub and therefore am done cutting that tree. Alright, let's uh, see if we can put a roof on this base. I also want to move all of these. I was talking about it last time. The base is three wide. The BCU um, can make it three and a third. <laughs> So, and this is actually only a half, so, I mean, you saw how tight that, that circle was. So, BCU extender is right here. We just need a circuit board, um, a metal ingot, and uh, five scrap metal, but we're going to need 80 mass. And uh, I didn't look, we're at 35. So, we can make all the stuff. Um, that's not very much food. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm just moving stuff so that I can see it. Oh my god. Ah, oh, so loud. Why? Why so loud? Oops, that doesn't go in there. Put it all away first. We'll get some water cooking. I can eat protein bars. Wow. I hope this ends soon. Does that go in there? Yeah. I'm overflowed on uh, grubs, so I can eat those. I'll just eat all of them. That'll bring my protein up. And that's almost done. And that doesn't go in there. That does. That does. I have, oh my god. I can't. I can't do it, man. It's just too much. I can't yell over something like that. So, um... Lots and lots of kelp I got as well as sandstone. And didn't I see? Oh, yeah, feathers. And we are way overflowed on this stuff. Now, what I can do is just... No, I don't want to do that because we won't be able to build. So let's go build something. I'll make that stuff later. I can go there. See, I have 16 of the protein bars, so yeah, we'll be in 100 grubs. We'll be fine. All right, we need the rest of the walls. We gotta wait for this mass to get 
um, to 100 so that we're not wasting energy building mass. Okay, so we need a window and two walls and two more walls and a window uh, and two walls. Did I not hit the window one? I didn't. Right? Okay, two windows, one, two, three, four, five, six walls. Okay. There we go. And then we're going to need roofing. And <clears throat> I think we can accomplish quite a bit today. I have quite a bit of materials, 212 nails, 101 planks. I think we will be able to finish, maybe finish the roof. And uh, work on that BCU extender. How, man, how I managed to get words out right when I needed to sneeze. <laughs> My problem is every time I come up here to check things out, I see loot. And uh, so that's what, <laughs> that's what I go for. <laughs> oh my god, stop! Ugh. That's another reason why winter is better. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, I made the wrong thing. Oh my god. Are they both little? Um, hello? They are. Oh. I need big walls, not little walls. How did I get over there? <laughs> I hope I can find a good reason to use those. Uh, and somewhere to put them as well. Oops. Hopefully that won't become a waste of material. There we go. Oops. I'm going to end up hitting that weird key again by accident. Uh, we also need to make a hatch for the roof. And after I make a hatch, then we can put that solar panel right on the roof. and. It will be able to um, get full sun on full sun days. Ah, my goodness. Nope, not yet. Uh, 59, okay. Uh, hatch. There we go, ladder hatch. We need four adhesive, two metal, and three um, of these. I have to have three sticking out. Overflow. Four adhesive for two metal and we can make a hatch. Uh, did I not pick up two metal? Oh, two metal. <laughs> of course. All right. And I think we are just going to stick to slanted roof. That seems like a good idea. So I think we might actually be able to get that finished. Hello? Hello? Alright, where do I want to... I think I'll put it right here. Is that going the right way? There we go. And we're on top of the world. Probably about to get hit by lightning. Okay. Put that away. Alrighty. Oh no, it can't go there. Silly. <laughs> it uh, it has to go in the middle. 
There we go. All right, let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. It's five wide, right? Okay. Yeah. Wow. Here we go. I have to turn every one of these around. There's the first one. Now, you see these walls that come down and this? I actually have two pieces I can put there, I guess. And I'll put a solid one on the other side. <laughs> Uh, no matter what I do, no matter which way I face, <laughs> that's kind of crazy, isn't it? Oh, it didn't snap. Maybe a little bit further. There we go. And then we'll have a flat roof and I'll have to block all those. I could raise it up to the roof level instead. I wonder if I can reach that. Let's try. Let's see if I can reach it. That was close. <laughs> I have to jump, but I can do it. Okay, oopsie. And I'm on the stairs. <laughs> All right. um, what's the matter? There it goes. <laughs> Uh, there is another option. You can, we can peak the roof, but uh, I need that flat space up there, you know, for power and stuff. Maybe from this side? We'll just nudge it closer to us. That's a headbanger. <laughs> and one more of those. Eventually I'll find the right button. All right, now we need to close that off and make uh, four more flat ceilings. Can I do it? <laughs> and one uh, half wall height because I am going to cheaply use those little partial walls. Is my fire about to go out again? No, it's actually fine. Wow. All right, where did I put it? Hmm? Over here. dark. Alright. That actually lights things up quite a bit better. And where is that one? Right there. So that's the wrong. It needs to turn. There we go. that in right? I can't see anything. No, this one is wrong. Um, Alright, I'm going to fix it later when it's not pitch black. Alright, there we go. Uh, I need another roof, 
I think. Oops, don't hit that weird button. I miscounted. Yeah. One more. Ah, we did it. <laughs> Managed with 24 planks and 35 nails left over. <laughs> oh, it's right here, actually. I can stop that. That was, I'm glad I caught that in time. I didn't want to waste it on the ceiling. Okay, top floor. Let's take this. And I think we'll put it... Uh, come up right here. Can I put it right there? Yes! I'm freezing. Freezing cold. <laughs> we might do a heater later on, but, uh, oh, wow, that was cool. We got all of those, and put that away for right now, and we're thirsty. Uh, oh, they're in here, aren't they? Where's my canteens? Yeah, put that away. All right, next, we have 94, and BCU extender. Uh, we need one circuit board, one metal ingot, and five scrap metal. Metal ingot, circuit boards, And BCU extender. Boom. <laughs> That's going to be really helpful. Uh, we are going to have to pr uh, put it somewhere. Um. I don't know how far it goes or if you can move it. It, oh, it has to be within the ex, it, within the BCU's range, right? So, yeah, we'll take that and we'll put it right here. How about that? And that will extend our BCU some distance. We can find out by picking this up. Okay, so that didn't extend the BCU, like, at all. Do I have to turn it on? Uh, how do I get rid of that? No, I didn't want to put that there, but uh, let's see here. Oh, I can't access that. Oh, it doesn't have any power. Um, why not? Um, okay. Well, put that in the comment section below. Because this, uh, apparently does not have any power at all. And it is definitely within the range, because that thing is. So, I don't know how to use that. I've never used one before, because I've never had a cause to. We are gaining power just fine. Because we're below 500, we're gaining power. And we're also gaining mass because it's below 100. Uh, let's see, we have a refinery. Mining drill. That is gonna take three ropes. So once again, we're back to cougar hunting. And, um, yep. Yeah back to cougar hunting to get any more power. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put this on the roof. Um, and probably I'm going to drop it a couple of times, I'm guessing. I don't know. 
can all, there we go. You can only move these things so far before they're like, nope, you're done. Okay. Oh, find the stairs. <laughs> and uh, open the hatch. And pick that up. I think behind us so we'll just start right there and the Sun is gonna come up just as we're ending that's pretty cool I'll probably encase all of this roofing in metal even though it's probably not necessary because this is pretty high up I doubt it's uh, I, you know I doubt that they can lob anything up this high they might be able to but I don't know if they will because once again, their target is that white dot down there. And uh, so they should be approaching from that direction. Um, the hunters and uh, the hunters, that is. Uh, if I turn on attacks, um, if I don't, then it'll be revenge attacks only. And we need their stuff, so... Yeah, in order to uh, get to a, a certain level of advanced, especially with the weapons, um, we need stuff from hunters, and the only way to get that is to confront them. And so they can either, I can either leave, leave them to attack us, uh, or I can attack them and start, you know, this circle of attack, revenge, attack, revenge. Um, if I put them on attacks, then they'll just attack us and I can take whatever they have if I can manage to kill them. Um, my uh, success rate against the hunters is one in one. <laughs> Which is not good. Can you just go down there? Uh, thank you. There we go. It's just slightly too high. <laughs> All right, let's go see what this roof looks like. Oh, yeah, I wanted to move these things. So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to move these things. Um, pretty quickly. The, w the flat roof does look kind of strange. But it's completely functional. And, oh, you can't see anything from here. How about over there? <laughs> we might have to climb a tall rock. <laughs> How about right here? Uh, not really. You can't really see much from here. It's too bright. But, uh, at any rate, uh, I am like, this is a huge amount of nails. And so super lucky, uh, super lucky to be able to get that many nails. Uh, there'll be another uh, stair here because this is janky as I'll get out. And I'm definitely going to be moving these uh, if I have the time to play. Ouch. <laughs> if I have the time to play, I'll make some more foundations and extend that all the way around the base before we get together next time. But we have a coat, we've got solar power started up, and I don't see any morning loot at all. Just fiber. <laughs> Give me that. All right. There is our super tall uh, base. <laughs> There it is. <laughs> and it's going to have that wall around it, foundation-wide, encased in metal, and um, railings and stuff on the front. Maybe a nice porch. And uh, once again, please tell me why the BCU extender doesn't have any power. Um, I don't know what else it could possibly require other than to just be plugged in. It's very strange. 
um, point thirty seven coming in. So we're getting some of that. All right, you guys. I want to thank you all so much for coming along. Uh, I'm going to move all this stuff and uh, redesign the outside. And uh, we might have a balcony or two with railings at some point. And uh, all of the parts of the base that's exposed on the outside uh, will have metal. I don't think we have to go very high up with the metal, but we'll see. Uh, if you're new to the channel, please go ahead and subscribe. We're learning subsistence together. Uh, if you're enjoying the content, then please click that like button. And as always, have an amazing day.